basically at this point we need to keep ERs clear for the most at risk. But as you think about your ICUs reaching a capacity potentially as the pandemic grows, like what do you need? What resources do you need and where can you get them and can you get them from federal government? Are there easy things the federal government can do for you? Well, I can tell you Danbury Hospital is already at capacity. And they have 200 nurses who are on furlough because they were in contact. If I could test those nurses, I could potentially get them back into the game Wait a, a second. lot sooner. You've got, you've got 200 nurses sitting on the sidelines right now who can't get back to work because they can't be tested to confirm whether or not they have the virus? Exactly. I mean, we got a surge in use, demand is going up, and I'm losing nurses by the day who have to furlough themselves for a period of time. That's a priority for testing for me. We're, our testing capacity is going up, but it's going up very incrementally, and that's dangerous. Um, 